Board of Public Works and Safety meeting for Thursday, April 11th, 2024 is now called to order. All board members and legal counsel are present. First, we will have approval of our minutes from April 4th, 2024. If there are no questions or comments, I make a motion to approve the minutes for April 24th, 2024 as presented. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. Next are claims for payment dated April 12th, 2024, and they are in the amount of $77,287.61. I make a motion to approve the claims for payment of $77,287.61. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. Next, we have a handicap sign and street closure requests, and Lieutenant Michael Black from the police department is present to present on these matters. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, I only have one new handicap request. It's going to be for Edith uh, Jensen. It's of 1360 Harris Street. I'll make a, if there are no questions or comments, I'll make a motion to approve the new handicap sign for 1360 Harris Street as presented. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Motion carried. Thank you. Uh, street closure for Hannah Snotty of the Richmond Parks and Recreation. Uh, she is requesting a street closure for the Summer farmer, Farmer's Market and the food trucks Wednesday even, events uh, beginning in May. Uh, there are four separate uh, request the first is uh, close the close the North Service Street between North Sixth Street and North Seventh Street on Fridays, from 6 p.m. Saturday at 1 p.m. in the months of May, June, July, August, September, and October, uh, for the farmers market vendors to set up and sell their goods. Mr. President, before we move on, uh, just looking at the agenda, we're calling out renewals. Handicap sign renewals, are there none? Are we, uh, are we moving past that? So we've we've had the practice of uh, approving those as a separate motion, even if they're not presented by liaison staff. Yeah, and so, so typically when nobody from the police department's here to present, or they won't come to the meetings if it's only handicap sign renewals, um, so typically don't present on them at least in the last six months or however long it's been. I think maybe since uh, the lieutenant's already presenting the street closures, we can circle back circle back to the handicap sign renewals once he's finished up. With that being said, I, I make a motion if there's no further comments or questions to approve the street closures as presented. All second. Motion's been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. Uh, Hannah has also requested the closure of North Service Alley or North Service Street between North 6th Street and North 7th Street on Mondays from 6 p.m. Tuesdays at 8 p.m. in the months of July, August, and September for the far farmers market vendors to set up and sell their goods on Tuesday Twilight Market events. There are no further questions or comments. I will make a motion to approve the street closure for the farmers market as presented. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. And in addition, uh, close North Service Street between North 6th Street and North 7th Street on Tuesdays from 6 p.m. to Wednesdays at 3 p.m. in the months of May through September for weekly food trucks, um, Eat Local Wednesdays events. No questions or comments. I'll make a motion to approve... Uh, the street closures for the uh, food trucks from May to September, as presented. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Motion carried. Thank you. And, and lastly, uh, they are requesting permission to install permanent gates on each end of the North Service Street. Uh, that will allow for easier street closures in the future um, and improve safety for the controlled access to the street. Those gates will not impact snow removal procedures and they have worked with the street department on a few options for gates. Uh, that would be appropriate to hopefully make this process easier for all involved. Um, I think what they're, they're having problems with cones being moved uh, is the request for those gates. So in the past, they've either been cones or like the wooden barricades or something like Correct. that, is that right? Okay. And to your knowledge, Lieutenant, is the, the street department doesn't have any concerns with 
putting more permanent structures uh, there? They have a representative here. Um, they have no concerns. Okay. Are these powered or are these manual? What, what are these? Do you know? I don't think they know yet. I think they're still looking into some options. It was more so just to bring it forward to make sure okay. that there wouldn't be any issues okay. moving forward. But Denise is, is working with streets to kind of figure out what the best game plan would be for that. Okay. Appreciate that. If there are no further comments or questions, I make a motion to approve the permanent gates uh, for the service of the Farmer's Market, as presented. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. Uh, we'll go back to the renewal of the handicap request. I have uh, four of those, one being Joe Moore of 417 Northwest E Street, uh, Douglas McKay, McDade of 925 Boyer Street, uh, Calvary Baptist Church is requesting a renewal at 121 Southwest East Street, and the last being Terry Smith of 526 North 22nd Street. There are no comments or questions. I make a motion to approve the handicap sign renewals at 417 Northwest East Street, 925 Boyer Street, 121 Southwest East Street, and 526 North 22nd Street. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. Thank you. Yep. And uh, Lieutenant, there was a, on the agenda, there is a final street closure for the third annual Fallen Brothers Memorial yes. Ride. Do you uh, thank you for reminding me of that last one there. Yeah, of course. Yes. Uh, yes, Randall White, uh, Vice President of the Max Place Incorporated, is requesting a street closure for the third annual. Fallen Brothers Memorial Ride. That event will be on May 11th at 10 a.m. to 11.30 p.m. The closure request is for F Street from the alley to South 8th Street. Okay. No more comments or questions. I make a motion to approve the uh, third annual Fallen Brothers uh, Memorial Ride street closure request Second. as presented. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Motion carried. Thank, Thank you. And next we have a change order, uh, change order number one to contract number 111-2021 for the comp Complete Streets Loop Project. We have Greg Steens, Director of Public Works and Engineering, present to tell us about this change order. Thank you, uh, dear board members. Uh, temporary light towers are needed to replace the current street lights on East Main Street from 7th to 10th Street. Milestone contractors will supply and maintain two light towers for 120 days during construction. The cost of the change order is $31,651.08. The City of Richmond will pay 100% of this change order from TIF funds. Greg, were these... Is that 120 days, the entire estimated? That's the uh, estimated time it's going to take to be in and out. And I think that's in in their contract, too. Okay, got uh, it. 120 days to close. Okay. Thank you. So, yeah. There are no more questions or comments. I'll make a motion to approve the change order number one to contract number 111-2021, Complete Streets Loop Project. Uh, in the not to exceed amount of $31,651.08 for temporary lighting. Second. Motion has been properly made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 Motion carried. Thank you. And we are now adjourned. <laughs>